Hey everybody, welcome back to this week's episode of Free Run. Last week's left us on a bit of a cliffhanger, which they're starting to pop up a little bit more than I like in Free Run. Free Run's kind of <laughs> kind of like my zen place my chill out zone and we're getting high intensity at points now let's find out what's going on we've got a couple of face-offs on the go let me know what you think of this episode down in the comments below and if you want to watch these unedited and in full link is in the description but without further ado let's get into this episode i'm ready for this off okay oh someone's cutting down trees he's deflecting is this against yeah ubel Okay, she's still getting hits on him though. That might have gone a bit hard. It didn't seem like it had really that much effect apart from like felling a bunch of trees. Like, is he gonna step in and show his power? Because he's meant to be quite powerful, isn't he? Underhanded, sole purpose of winning. See, I don't think he's going to kill her. <laughs> Fun! <laughs> Chucking out the attacks. Look at them all. Saturation attack. Look at all these attacks, man. Surely. It doesn't look like she's having too much bother, mind. Is, is she gonna take it down? Free ran in with a win. Oh come on! Free ran's totally gone and won that, but like she would, she wouldn't have hurt her. Just like stopped her from attacking her. You know what I mean? That's what they use to catch the bird, isn't it? The steel. That was, yeah, to be fair. He could, but he seems to do a lot more talking than actions, you know what I mean? I don't think he'd kill her. I just from that. Yep. Yeah, why didn't you just take it before? That would make sense. What's she gonna do? Distraction, maybe? So he's looking up, she's gonna attack him, she's gonna attack him! Oh, I mean, that was our chance right there. Right. I mean, it would. Right. That smile, you know what I mean? That smile on her bell. I don't think she is. I don't think you. You're the one like delaying. Isn't he? Oh no. Oh, that's horrible. Oh, that is, that is too much. That's too much, man. That's horrible. That's, that imagery is horrible. He's stolen major time, man. I mean, it's good, but. I don't get why, you know? Your hands are already drenched in blood and yet you still want to remain human. He really doesn't, like... 
Okay, so he's preparing himself to kill. But don't. Oh, but you know. Everyone I had to. That's quite a statement. Everybody I had to. He doesn't have to kill her though. Burn in for the save. Get in. Burn in the house. You know what I mean? Nah. Yes, she did. She was. Nah. Nah. Don't believe that. Fern wouldn't kill. She might have wounded her, knocked her out. Do not believe for one second that Fern killed her. Nah. I'll be, I'll be more than disappointed if it comes to be true, but I'm very confident that she hasn't. Oh, <laughs> You'll be turning an unnecessary kill back into a necessary one. What a line. Interesting, like, turn of events. How this is all playing out. Ubel and Wubel would, would make quite the couple. You know what I mean? Oh. What's that? Oh, bro. Like your arms literally almost sliced off. These are petals. Turn them into metal. Look at him. Like legit. Ah. How is he not writhing in agony right now? This looks helpless, dude. Before our battle begins, you're in the middle of it, man. <laughs> what? It's a decoy! Are you kidding me right now? That's cool, magic. That is cool. More like a clone. Whoa. I don't trust other people. What? You know what I mean? Nah, see? We knew Fern wouldn't. We knew it. It was, it was obvious she wouldn't kill somebody. Uh, error. Yes, she did. <laughs> yeah, I believe you. You seeing the state of things right now. That's <laughs> She must be one nasty monster. Why has he made that assumption? <laughs> Carry me on your back. Oh well, I didn't expect him to actually do it. He's been taken well and truly down. Knocked out. <laughs> He's like, really? <laughs> I love that sound. You know, like rain hitting your window or the roof or a tent if you're camping. It's such a lovely, lovely sound. Three hours, man. There's something about him. Right, what do you do it for? What is it you desire then? Okay, and they moved, they moved, they fled. Oh, who else has got major Mikasa vibes looking at that image right there? 
the scarf color, the way she's drawn. It's Mikasa! <laughs> it's major Mikasa vibes right now with that drawing. But anyway. I wonder if it's her. What an idiot. It wouldn't be surprise it wouldn't be too surprising if this anime made that little girl be her without him realizing it. Maybe. No. <laughs> well, you can catch that one. Just look at it, right? Use that spell thing. Yep, you didn't need to steal one. Just get your own. <laughs> oh, you know what? Of course. <laughs> We've still got everything happening with free rent. With free rent. <clears throat> And Levine and Kanye right now? Good. Wow, she didn't even feel like it taken from her hand. Right, let's get it back. We've only got three hours. Less than three hours. Let's just get that back now. Proctor for the second test. Looks like you killed a few promising test takers again. <laughs> Immune to mana detection for a mage test wasn't nice. Yeah, more tact, more planning. Look is a skill. Denken, his skill is comparable to a first class major's. Tomi which means Free Ren could probably track her. I mean, I find it annoying because we 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 had the we had the bird, we had to wait a few more hours, and then we were done. Could say that. <laughs> Famous Free Ren. They do age just very slowly, you know? No, no, no. Well, they do age, just they live a lot longer than us. No, you won't. Free will stop you from doing that. Like, no brainer. What's his deal, Denken? I don't. I, we're obviously going to find out more about him then. Yeah. It's just the title, it's not worth killing people for. The Great Mage and Founder. Who? City? She will grant them any one spell they desire. A living grimoire. Literally. <laughs> Another elf, man. Another elf. It is like a whole genie in the lamp sort of thing, you know what I mean? <laughs> 
たった三時間寝かしつけるだけガキのおもりくらいできるだろう。でんけん。He's got this kind of formidable presence about him. Ah, crusher. Back off. おいぼれが。That ain't gonna happen. What's he doing? Oh. Well, we know he's just going to put them to sleep because he just wanted to put them to sleep until the end of the competition, which is three hours. Well, the first stage in the competition. But Free Ren's going to take down this dude, isn't he? Is she? Like, he's going to be no bother. Ho 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 ho! Come on. What's oh, Denkin's deal, man? Oh, referee. There's just no need. <laughs> <laughs> this is a two weeks, two weeks now. The first, like the second cliffhanger we're being left off on. Like free Ren is my zen. It's like almost like my meditation anime. You know what I mean? <laughs> We've got everything frantic going on in the world of action anime, and this one is the one I come to to like sit back, relax, and chill. And since we got into this competition to get labelled, you know, first class, <laughs> it's. <laughs> It's getting tense, man. But what's Denkin's deal? We've got to find out more about him. We know there's another elf now called City. I mean, that's that's pretty cool. Considering when we started this, you know, Freyom is like, she doesn't know if and how many there are. But now we've seen drum total of three, including Free Ren, obviously. But what's the deal there, then? Why is she in search of these powerful? But anyway... Free Ren's obviously going to win and obviously going to meet her. And I say these words, obviously, because it's almost like we're getting... Uh, walked along an incredible journey at a pace that we find tense at points, but still comfortable. As how I would, how I would like describe Free Ren. If I was to say to someone, if you're going to watch it, it's like an adventure. It'll have it'll have action. It's got scenes of magic. It's got tense, but you're getting walked along at a pace that's comfortable. I like that. Anyway, but seen we've seen fern absolutely later smackdown we've seen we're kind of learned about Werbel and ubel they're very interesting characters who i think would make an interesting uh evil couple you know <laughs> you know what i mean but Werbel's story about the the young girl who was very much drawn like mikasa in my opinion maybe that's the girl he's now carrying on his back who i didn't write down the name of but let me know if you think i've missed anything from that episode down in the comments below and obviously hit that subscribe button and much love from me Let's do this.